Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we are unboxing and reviewing another set of the V-Series Craftsman hand tools uh, for the, that I picked up during the holiday season of 2024. This is the eight piece uh, screwdriver set. Uh, was $20, uh, which is fantastic price because the quality of this is really good. <clears throat> Based on some uh, reviews I read on online. Um, so this is the box it comes in and some information on the box. One of them is the model number CMHT65618V. And it says on the box as well, uh, full lifetime warranty right there. And it says eight pieces and up to 10 times more durable. Now it has an asterisk right here. So if we look on the back, let's read the information because it has an asterisk on top again. So on the top it says precision machine tips and premium alloy steel for up to 10 times greater durability. And here is the asterisk again. So if we come down here to the asterisk, it tells us it is on average when tested versus Craftsman quarter inch slotted CMHT65059. So they tested it against their own uh, uh, screwdriver. And then other features, soft touch grip with two times solvent protection. And now we have two asterisks. So if we come down here to the two asterisks uh, clarification, tested on two times more solvents than required by ASME, ASME standard B107.600. All right, and then it says here, uh, pro handle design blends precision, torque and control, wide bolster for high torque wrenching select sizes so some of these here have big bolsters that you can use and uh, a wrench to apply more torque if you need to but not all of them just few of them I suspect the big ones and here are the sizes included it looks like we have long ones and we have short ones slotted and Phillips. And the same statement that is on the other tools here uh, for the warranty, lifetime warranty. It says return damaged product to a stocking retail partner or call this number for details. No proof of purchase required. And this set is made in France as of 2021. Now I got this shipping from Lowe's, so they may have shipped it to me from a store that is not recently uh, uh, produced product. So if you are in a store and you see the holiday display and they have this thing on there and you pick it up, most likely this, num this year number will be maybe 2024 or 2023, but this is from 2021. So same thing, it's just an older uh, built product. Um, let's go ahead and open it. And apparently it comes in this nice tray which is cool. So this tray is not flimsy or anything. It's actually, it's actually much stronger than other trays I've seen with ratchets and stuff. This is really nice tray, I'm keeping it. <laughs> I'll just keep them sitting in the tray. Um, but it's really nice. All right, so let's see, what do we have? So we have this giant one, this is the biggest. And this handle is nice. And here is the wrenching uh, bolster. See how thick this thing is? It has the model number etched on it, laser etched. It's 
pretty nice. This is the Phillips head. Another flat head. Another Phillips head. And a smaller Phillips. This is the most common, so that's Phillips too. And this is the quarter inch. Hey okay, guys, for $20, this is a fantastic price for it. So if you find this or you can get it shipped to you, pretty nice. I would say go for it. <laughs> this is the smallest one here. It's one eighth uh, slotted. Let's put this on the side. And let's talk about some of the things they have mentioned here on the listings page. Um, so they are talking about it being tool truck quality within reach. That's what they call these. So these, instead of being on a tool truck, you can get them on in the store, same quality, but better price. Now, of course, for $20, it's a fantastic price. Um, premium alloy steel, this thing here. Uh, precision machine tips, right there. I don't know if they are magnetic or not. They are not magnetic, which is fine. You don't have to be. And the design of the handle, the design of the handle, they call it, they designed it with the mechanic in mind. So that means it's a pro handle design. I don't know how true that is, but it's very comfortable handle. And let's see. Um, so let's see what kind of size will fit this. Um, let me get my set here. And this is a bad example because it's best to use an open-ended wrench for these, but let's, for the sake of it, we'll just try one of these box ends. It's too big. Okay, so. 14 was too big, we will try 13. Yeah, so 13 fits perfect, okay. I don't have a, a bolt, I'm sorry. I hit the tripod one more time. Um, I don't have a, a screw that is this big, so we will use the smaller uh, number two Phillips, but you get the idea if you have an application where you are trying to tighten a screw and it's just not loosening or not tightening you can add this to it a wrench preferably open-ended so you can you know or maybe ratcheting even yeah. and apply more torque to it so that's what the idea is behind that design so what we will do now is we will uh, try to screw these two screws into pieces of wood. So I have these two, they're not long, just uh, one and a quarter inch long. Um, so we will, oh, this is, oh my, this is very, very good fit. Look at that. It's not moving. <laughs> wow. It's not magnetic, so it's falling off, but it's very, very good fit. Man. So what we will do is we will just put them into the wood here. Really quick. And this is very soft wood, of course. So it will be easy. So the wood split. 
Yeah, it's very soft wood. So this one seems harder. I've had this for a while. I think it's a two by six piece, uh, pressure treated. So this will be much harder to put this screw in. Let's see. It might crack as well, but let's try. Very nice fit. What I'm trying to see is if it's going to strip it like the clutch one did. So the screwdriver tip is still fine. The screw itself is fine. I'm gonna gonna try it in a bit harder yeah it's a uh, the tip survived you know just using my hand and this is countersunk a little bit so it's doing its job unlike the clutch one kind of stripped as soon as I applied a little bit of uh, force to it but they replaced it for me under warranty anyhow um, so yeah this is just a quick video um, on these uh, screwdrivers from Craftsman V series they're very nice and this this plastic is hard shell so this can be used as a tray very nicely don't worry about it flexing or anything it's you can see here it's like almost hard plastic I bought I bought uh, one of these like for eight dollars um, it wasn't molded like this so it wasn't custom fit but it's just a tray that is strong enough this is almost like that if, if they sell this without the molded there it might be four or five dollars just for this Maybe two dollars. This piece of plastic, but it's very sturdy. All right, so I think this concludes the video. If you have any comments or questions about this uh, product, please leave them in the comment section below, and I will leave a link to it in the description of the video for you to click on and go to the website and purchase them if available. Um, if you felt this video was awesome, uh, subscribe to the channel and uh, give it a thumbs up and maybe share the video if one of your colleagues are looking to buy the same set. That would be nice. And give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Thank you so much. I'll see you all in the next video. Have a wonderful day.